Everybody, artists and sculptors have the sh chance to showcase their talent at the Young Concrete Sculptors Awards. Yesterday, the competition opened for South African artists to begin to work on their entries. The competition is brought about by the PPC and the Association of Arts Pretoria in order to give emerging artists the chance to showcase their skills. Now, this year, the competition's theme is Reimagine Concrete. And today in studio, we have got Sibongile Nonku from PPC and Sebrant Vegas, who is a previous winner in this competition. Good to have you. Welcome to One Live, both of you. Thank you. All right, you let's, let's begin with you, Sibongile. Um, what made PPC want to get involved in a competition like this? This competition actually started when we were celebrating a centenary. And with that centenary, centenary celebration, we decided to create this competition, which actually encourages people to look at cement differently. It's not about the great powder, it's what you can do with it. Yeah. So we actually started this competition where we were encouraging artists to actually use concrete, concrete being a mixture of cement, sand and gravel and water to actually make their masterpieces. So we're encouraging them to use the medium of concrete. All right, uh, Sarah, you won this competition. Mm. When did you win it? Were you last, were, last year's winner? No, I won in 2006. So okay. I won the Technical Award or uh, the Technical Excellence Award. And what was it like working with cement? Is it something that you do or was this a, a, a first chance for you to try it out? I actually entered the competition first time in 1992 when they started. Mm. And cement is a, is a lovely, it's a, because it's such an old, uh, material, it's a lovely material to work in for sculpture. It's technically difficult, but it's yeah. part of the challenge that makes it fun. Y your piece is actually, there we go, we're looking at it, there it's on go. screen. Yes. Uh, for viewers that can't actually see it, that's, those are cards. So just explain to me how you did that. I mean, is it, are those actual cards in the cement? No, I actually cast uh, probably about 200 little cement cards or, or little cards in cement. It's just plain cement the way that you would use normal cement. Yeah. Um, I wanted to sort of push the material to its sort of limit to try and get those really thin, really flimsy, to try and get away from the idea of concrete as being a heavy material. Yeah. I wanted to go with a really thin, get it. It was quite a technical challenge, but in the end of the day, I think it was a very successful piece. Well, it certainly was. You, <laughs> ended up, you, you won with well, this piece. the technical award, yeah. Oh, there you go. What do you win for, for, for something like this? Uh, the prize money at this stage, I think it's... He won um, in 1990, he was part in 1992 and yeah. he won in 2000 2006. 2006. So but now for this year, we've got two categories in terms of the fine art uh, sculpture category. There are four prizes there. The grand prize is 50,000, then the runner-up is 25,000, and then we've got two merit awards for 5,000 rand each. And for the functional art category, there's only one one uh, winner there okay. for 15,000. I, I want to talk about this piece that's next to me. I mean, this is, this is stunning. Mm. Who did this? Who's the artist? And just tell us a little bit about it. It's actually Esti Nell okay. who actually did that sculpture. Esti Nell? Yes, it was right. Esti Nell who actually did that sculpture. Beautiful. Is this, from, is, is, this, is this an entry for this year or is this from a previous year as well? It's actually for previous years. Okay. Yeah. Beautiful. Did she mm. win with this piece? She was actually a runner-up during runner that up. year. Wow. Mm. A runner-up. I'd like yes. to see who the winner was. Yeah. I mean, this is absolutely... Mm. I mean, the work is amazing. Yeah. But but never mind that. Let's yeah. let's zoom in on your necklace here because yeah. the, from the minute yeah. you sat down, that's all yeah. I've been staring at. Talk yeah. to us about this necklace. Um, this is an example of functional art in terms of what we're looking for. In terms of functional art, we're looking for an artwork that is uh, that goes beyond its aesthetic look. It must have a practical use. So there we're looking for jewelry. Um, this sure. the ring. I'm looking at that as well. Yes, mm. and for example, our technical manager actually did um, his wedding band using concrete as well. Okay. So they we actually saying to people for functional art, you can actually do stuff, clocks, um, furniture, some electronics using concrete. So we actually saying the limitation yeah. is actually your imagination. We can do anything with concrete. You talk about being functional, but Sibongile. How do you wear concrete around your neck <laughs> and on your fingers? Can I feel that? Yes. This ring? Because that looks, that looks heavy. No, it's not heavy. It's not heavy? You yeah. don't think so? It's actually not that heavy. 
Yeah. I'm not sure I could get too much work done, but I mean, it's it's so well done. What is this? As, is this part, as, an, as part of an accessory, it's really yeah. nice. It's fantastic. It's actually what Excellent. we use for South African Fashion Week. PPC was part of South African Fashion Week, yeah. and the models were actually wearing, wearing um, the yes. cement assurance. It's mm. fantastic. Something different. Yes. Uh, the entries, um, how, how do artists submit their work? Let's quickly end off with that. Is there a website or somewhere they can go? Okay. They can go onto our website to get um, the entry form. So we need the entry form and they also need to submit their artworks that different regional places where they can submit their artworks so we're not going photographic entries this year we're going with physical entries then we'll judge them but we need a concept statement for them to explain what they were trying to do there and as well as their um, their statement that will explain the whole process as to how they use their cement and everything fantastic well thank you very much and well done to you for the incredible work that, uh, that, that you have done and for winning the competition. Uh, Sibon Gile Nongu, who's from PPC, thank you very much for joining us. And of course, uh, Sebrant, who is a winner for two years uh, previously to this year. Sebrant Vichers, uh, who's uh, joining us in studio.